Our dear old friend Mr. Rogers made a career out of being a good neighbor and an inspiration to us all. Recently, Danielle Allen met a couple of woodworkers who began their business with the goal of being good neighbors to local youth by mentoring young men, teaching them a trade and having lots of fun in the meantime. There are three things you'll always find at Maple Built in North Nashville. A lot of wood, a lot of sanding, and a lot of creative pieces from brothers Will and Skylar Anderson. It's hard to describe an average afternoon at Maple Built because so much of what we do varies day by day. Um, it always has a general theme of woodworking to it, so there will always be sanding, there will always be chop saws going. At Maple Built, they make a little bit of everything. Home decor, large mosaics, and custom pieces for places around town. But Will and Skylar are doing more than just reshaping wood. They're also transforming lives. Pulling this guy down, lining it up to 14 and a half. That looks pretty good, so good to you. Here, okay, start it. We roughly say Maple Built is a season of life where we invite young men from particularly North Nashville but or surrounding areas to join us here to employ, train, and mentor. Teenage boys can do a six-month apprenticeship here. It's a chance to learn the art of woodworking and some life lessons along the way. But there's also been afternoons where we just kind of shut it down and talk about, you know, getting shut down for prom. And so sometimes it's just processing high school boy stuff. So why woodworking? Well, it's a skill you can use in any career. Woodworking is such a great teaching tool because it's immediate response. It's if you do something well, you see it immediately. If you do something poorly, you also see it immediately. And there's something different about doing something and being a part of something that when it's finished, you can be like, wow, I made that. Will got the idea for a woodworking shop back in 2012. He had just moved to the Salem Town area, and he was on a mission to answer one question. How can I be a good neighbor? A big part of being a good neighbor was asking my neighbors what they thought instead of showing up and then just kind of declaring this is what my neighborhood needs. Because honestly, the things that I probably would have prescribed as needs like are not things that the neighborhood would have identified for itself. But I heard a lot of concern, you know, concerned moms and aunts and grandmothers worried about, you know, what came next for the, the young men and their families. And so Maple built as we are, it were a step in the process of just trying to continue to address that need of creating a space where young men can, can figure out what comes next. Now, if you want to know the entire story behind Maple Built, you have to start with skateboards. That's what got this whole thing rolling. Started as a skateboard company, and that's what we did for about four years, and we did skateboards exclusively. And in 2016, we, we wanted to be able to do more. We had started to tinker around in the wood shop, doing more projects, and uh, for the sake of kind of brand confusion, we, we started Maple Built. There's a skateboard park right next to the building, and you can find Will showing off his skills every now and then. But uh, you don't expect to see Skylar out there. I cruise. I uh, had a lot of skateboard accidents growing up, um, and now that I'm on my own insurance and, and I'm an adult, um, I don't like paying deductibles. So, but you and you end up doing it. But I end up doing it anyway. So uh, I cruise around. I don't necessarily hit the park anymore. With new designs like this Dolly Parton skateboard, Will and Skylar are staying true to their roots, but they never shy away from a challenge. Honestly, it's just kind of been figuring it out as we as we go along, just taking increasingly difficult projects. Like yesterday, we had a, a client who asked for something and as we're sitting at the desk, Skylar said, you know, we can pitch them something we know how to do or we can pitch them something that scares us a little bit. No matter what Will and Skylar create, there's one thing that they're most proud of. 
I love that the work that I spend the majority of my life doing like does something good and provides something good for my city and my neighborhood and like my streets. I love that I can leave at the end of the day. I can be tired, I can be covered in sweat and dust, but know that like the work I did today was important.